And how you guys doing? This is very important in reference to my mother and father's properties and companies and businesses. Of course, I'm supposed to be tax-free for a lot of reasons because the government tried to murder me when I was little. The government tried to steal all the estates of my parents from me. The government got prosecuted. And then they've tried again several other times to try to steal everything from me. Those people have to get prosecuted. But in reference to the companies and the company guidelines and the company properties, and, you know, my parents owned all kinds of different companies. But, you know, in reference to the property tax, you know, my parents were supposed to be tax-free too, but look up the information in reference to the expenses of the companies. Those That comes out of accounts at the companies, right? Now, who owns the companies? These people that I'm the owner of my mother and father's companies, and I'm the owner forever. But this is where somebody might, might question how the hell these people are trying to block me from my mother and father's properties of which it is on documents that I'm the owner of all the properties of my mother and father's estates and companies and businesses and new locations and old locations. So somebody needs to answer the question. Maybe the, the deeds department could answer this or something. Or the IRS. How are these people blocking me from my mother and father's mansions? When... The companies are uh, the properties are ran on a budget that my parents had set up for me. So how are they, you know it's from my direct parents? How are these people trying to reside on property that I'm the owner of, and these people are holding me hostage as their way of embezzling time on property, where they're trying to steal everything from me? You know what I mean? Like look at all the expenses of the company. And look at, I mean, in reference to a generalization, and the budgets of the companies, and payroll, and all the people that are employed that are on the accounting department budget or whatever. Look at the information in reference to corporate law and the fact of my mother and father's companies, of which I am the owner of. How are these people trying to block me from the property when these people need to get fired from the companies and they need to get fired from any of the locations and they need to get thrown off the properties that they tried to steal because I'm the owner and these people are trying to block me from my mother and father's mansions. My parents didn't have no debts. Do you understand that? And any accusations of anybody trying to put their expenses on me those people would have to get arrested. But do you understand the information? Like these people are trying to block me from my mother and father's mansions, of which I grew up in those mansions before these people had kidnapped me, you know. And I was rescued and kidnapped and rescued and kidnapped several times. But, you know, in reference to the situation, how are these people claiming to be executives or uh, managers or business people of the companies when they're being paid by the accounting department, they're burning my teeth really bad right now, too. Do you, do you think you own other people's teeth, man? You think that's funny, don't you? You're trying to steal real body parts so you can get the death penalty. You're damaging real body parts. They're not fake. They've never been fake. And what you have done was damaged real teeth. Those are real body parts. Real teeth, real x-rays are documented. You touching anything on my body that's real can get you the death penalty. Do you understand that, Satellite Man? No fucking matter who you are. There's term limits in government. And there's an impeachment process of every branch of government. So no matter what position you reside in, in the American government, that's not a lifelong position. There is absolutely no lifelong positions in the American government. Do you understand that? So your conduct can always get prosecuted if you're violating my anatomy or you're violating the laws of this country, government man. There is no lifetime position in those positions of government or in satellite control rooms. Do you understand that? Because that's the facts. And there's term limits in reference to political administrations. Any conduct out of the guidelines of the law 
can get you prosecuted whether you're in office or whether you're out of office whether you're trying to continue in office and you're violating me or you're violating my anatomy with your satellite surveillance that you denied ever was going on you can get prosecuted for denying it too and you can get life in prison so back to the point of the companies and properties of these politicians fabricating that they thought somebody owed them something when they were holding me hostage as a Screen Actors Union sued the state of Indiana for the abuses and mutilations and me being held hostage what about other unions or, or you know the Screen Actors Union is a different kind of union you know it's kind of uh, entertainment acknowledgments but you know in reference to uh, the point of information or the directors guild or the screen actors guild or the writers guild or cinematographers or the media tv stations radio stations or you know history of things have they sued these government people in indiana or these politicians that have violated my anatomy and they've violated my life They can get them, they can go after them and impeach the Screen Actors Union can easily impeach a president and basic information if they're attacking celebrities. You guys know that, right? Lots of things of importance. And basic information. And governors and mayors and political regimes that are trying to destroy the careers of popular people or famous people in history in America too. Lots of things of importance. But you know, in reference to these people that are blocking me from my mother and father's properties, which my parents gave me everything and these people are trying to block me from everything, did these people claim that they were paying the budget of the companies or they were... Who do these people think they are? What expenses did these people think came out of their pocket in reference to my mother and father's properties? Need the information. Get it on record. Get those people on television or YouTube and question them. Tell them to provide uh, proof of information.